So the question is, where do such space visitors come from? Astronomers have found that the three interstellar objects we discovered came from totally different parts of the galaxy. And each of them has its own age and background. 3i Atlas turned out to be the oldest, about 4.6 billion years old, and it came from the Milky Way's thick disk. That's a region filled with older stars that have fewer heavy elements. 1i Oumuamua is much younger, around 1 billion years old. It came from the galaxy's thin disk, where new stars are still being born. Oumuamua, Hawaiian for a messenger from afar arriving first, was the first known object from another star system to pass through our solar system. Basically, the first interstellar guest. It was super stretched out, about 10 times longer than it was wide, unlike anything else we've spotted in space. It also sped up in a way that couldn't be explained by gravity alone. Changes in brightness showed it was tumbling end over end instead of spinning smoothly. At first, scientists were confused because the space body didn't have a tail or a cloud of gas like a normal comet, even though it was accelerating. That led to a lot of debate about what it was made of and where it came from. Just like with 3i Atlas, some people wondered if it could be technology created by a space civilization. But most scientists now think Oumuamua was a totally natural object, just a really weird one. The best guess is that it was a comet releasing invisible hydrogen gas, which caused it to speed up slightly. Sadly, by the time astronomers found it, it was already heading out of the solar system, so there wasn't much time to study it. As for 2i Borisov, it sits in between at roughly 1.7 billion years old. It also came from the thin disk. It was the first confirmed comet to come from another star system and it gave scientists a super rare peek at what materials beyond our solar system were made of. The comet was discovered in 2019 by Gennady Borisov, an amateur astronomer who actually built his own telescope to search for faint space objects. Unlike the first interstellar visitor, Oumuamua, which looked more like an asteroid, Borisov behaved like a classic comet. It had a bright coma, that's a temporary fuzzy atmosphere of gas and dust forming around the comet's nucleus as it approaches the sun. Plus, it boasted a long tail of dust and gas. Studying 2i Borisov helped researchers learn more about how other planetary systems form.